back to the channel so first of all just log in with your credentials now just scroll down a little bit and first of all we have to create one simple bucket so just copy your project id uh, search for bucket open this thing in new tab meanwhile just click on activate cloud shell and uh, click on continue now go to your bucket click on create paste the project id over here click on continue 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 uncheck this checkbox and click on fine grains click on continue and simply click on create now it will take few seconds so just wait for that now it's done now just uh, watch the video carefully from here to copy like here like this then go to your dashboard let, let me just increase the text size uh, okay so like this paste over here okay now copy your project id and paste your command also look like this there is no space between after the double forward slash and hit enter and if you face uh, any issue over here so that's when you didn't paste or uh, modify this command uh, properly so please do that thing okay once you're done with this now if you just scroll down a little bit we have to just give one more permission so come over here click on this refresh so you can see like uh, one png file over here now simply click on permissions then click on grant access for the principal type all users like this one and yeah now for the role copy this thing you can copy all users from here also okay now paste over here and choose the second one and simply click on save click on allow public access and it will be done now if you just come over here and click on check my progress so it's take time to update a score so do not worry about that uh, like if you just get uh, this kind of error okay so meanwhile let me just open the load balancer open this thing in new tab now if i just click on check my progress once again i got a score so as i told you it take a few minutes to update the score so now just open the load balancer now click on load balancer from here choose http load balancer click on that now choose like uh, from internet uh, vm like first one vm to serverless and from here choose the second one like classic click on continue now from the for the name copy this cdn lb paste over here okay now if you can see like for front end configuration please make sure that your protocol is http ipv4 ephemeral uh, port is 80 now if is all these thing are uh, already chosen for you simply click on done if not that please make the changes accordingly now click on backend configuration now click on this now click on create bucket now for the bucket name scroll down a little bit copy this thing carefully and paste over here do not include any extra space now click on browser click on this now simply select now make sure that you have click on check this uh, enable cloud cdn now for all this thing change into one minute one minute and one minute like this now simply click on create and click on ok so if you can over see over here like they have uh, after that they have configured the front end so we already configured the front end now if you just click on review and finalize so you can just final uh, check that all the things like it must be look like this as shown in this page you are also look like this and simply click on create if all the if both the parties are uh, correct you can simply click on the create now it will take few seconds to create the load balancing so just wait for that
so it's done now now if you just come over here and click on check my progress you got a score uh, you don't need to do this task number three if you, if you want you can just end the lab if you still have any doubt please let me know in the comment section thanks for watching guys have a good day